So I partnered with Ziyun to shoot a music video using the Weeble S, and I kind of wanted to do this to show what it's like in an actual production environment and to see how this thing handles in like a full day of shooting and what it works like with a payload that we had on it. Today we're on set with an upcoming artist named Dallas. She's from Toronto. She's super talented and we're shooting a video for the song called Superpowers. I'm Travis Didluck. I'm the director on today's music video with Dallas. So yeah, with the concept of this video um, and the song being called Superpowers, we decided it would be a good idea to really lean into the superpowers thing um, and have Dallas play with this fire ability that she can kind of control with her mind. Um, really playing with like abstract B-roll sort of things where she's kind of in and out of focus. Um, and yeah, should be cool. Stoked. Yeah, start up a little higher. Pan down. Yeah, there's good. Cool. Reset, camera. Rolling. Playback. Playback. Action! Superpowers on my side. And no, I don't care what you say. And I just want to fly. Keep talking about my business. Keep it real, now don't you lie. My venom runs in you like no other type. Get ready for the hype. Yeah, yeah. So, on a production like this, I generally would be using a bigger camera and a bigger gimbal for something like this. But with the Weebill S, we've got this small compact package with a gimbal that actually has enough power to handle you know, a bigger camera like the Blackmagic 6K, which is what we use for this shoot. The only issue is that the camera's so wide and the gimbal's so compact. So in order to balance it, we had to actually use a counterweight to offset the weight, and that way it could actually balance properly. And it has the same modes and features that the Weeble Lab has, but with 300% more motor torque. Camera. <laughs> The new image transmission module is actually really awesome. It's a cool addition to have to this because uh, for a scenario like this, when we're on set with the director, uh, focus puller, and the client, we can give them all their own separate monitors and this thing will sync up you know, to your iPad, to your iPhone, and everyone can have their own monitor. Filmmaking tools on this app are pretty cool, like focus peaking and false color, just like you would have on a normal field monitor. I would say the biggest challenge we had was when the hazer set off the fire alarm and the fire alarms were flashing everywhere in the house and the alarm was going off and we were trying to uh, stop that from happening. The gimbal ran without any issues. Uh, it's also cool that we were able to put it into underslung mode by taking the handle off and sticking it on the top. It only has two batteries and it basically ran the full 12 hours without swapping batteries. We've got two on either side and this should be like almost like a key light on here. Get a shot of this first. Oh, you already sick. In the yeah, exactly. Her a blurry, a blurry. Yeah, background. that's awesome. That was amazing. That's a wrap. Yeah.